Alright, this video is going to show you guys how to free up some free space. As you can see, I have 726 right there megabytes of storage. Okay, so I'm going to turn on my Wi Fi here. <clears throat> We're going to go into Cydia. Go into Cydia here. I'm just going to cancel this up here. I'm doing this on my iPad too. So now what you're going to do is you're going to go into sources and you're going to add this source in right here. That source right there. Once you have that source added, you're going to go over to search and you're going to search mobile terminal. Okay. Now you're going to see right here mobile terminal. Okay. You go up to install. Confirm it. Okay, and then you'll just return to Cydia. Go back into search. Okay. Now you're going to type in S Y S C L E A N. Now you're going to see SysClean Pro, which is right here. <clears throat> now what you're going to do is you're going to hit install. Hit confirm. Just let it do its thing. Return to Cydia. Now, we're going to get back out of this. <clears throat> now you're going to have terminal on your device. So we're going to go into terminal here. Okay, so you see terminal. I'm going to click on terminal. So now you're going to see this right here. Okay, so you're going to type in S U. And you're going to go to return. Now, depending on what your password is, usually the standard's Alpine. If you change it, then you're going to have to type in your change one. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go like this for right now. Okay. Now it's going to bring this up. So it's going to look just like that. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to type in S-Y-S-C-L-E-A-N-P-R-O. Okay, once that's typed in, hit return. It's going to go with, do its little business. So now this process takes a while. <clears throat> what you're going to want to do is it's going to remove language packs and it's going to remove keyboards. So if you do not need this stuff on your device, like certain language packs, certain keyboards, whatever the language, whatever it may be, you're just going to click yes, and just hit Y, and then hit return. So we're going to let this thing do its thing. It takes a while. So don't get frustrated if it seems like it's freezing up or it seems like it's not doing anything. Don't close out of it. Don't go into, <clears throat> into another application because if you do, it's going to close this terminal out and you're going to have to redo it all. So just a quick, quick little run through here I'll show you exactly how to go about this I'm not gonna do a complete video of going through the whole thing because once you get the gist of it it's pretty self-explanatory you just keep on clicking yes return yes return yes return it'll warn you <clears throat> saying that this is your last and final chance are you sure you want to delete this just click yes it'll go through do its whole thing then once you actually get to the very bottom it will say would you like to uninstall me I click no, just to keep it handy, just to keep it, you know, why not have it? So, I mean, you can uninstall it if you want to. I just like to keep it, because you never know. You might need it again. So, hopefully this updating database hurries up here. So now it's going to show you a little bit of stuff. Okay, so remove foreign voice files. Click yes, then hit return. Okay, now it's going to move it. Just click yes, return. So now it's moving everything where it needs to move it to. So now it's removing 
retina option even though the iPad 2 doesn't have retina display but either which way okay now this is what I was talking about yes return yes return just keep on hitting it unless you need that language for some odd reason So I'm going to delete all these. I mean, it's a lot of stuff, so just keep on clicking yes. Oops, I clicked T. I want to hit yes. Okay, now it says, this is your last chance. Are you sure you want to delete? Click yes, let it do its thing. And now we'll do language packs. Now you do the same thing for language packs as well. So I might just end up doing this whole video just so people don't get confused and don't get discouraged and, oh, well, now I don't know what to do. Again, if it seems like it stalls out, kind of like mine's doing right now, don't worry. That's it. It's just finding what it needs to find, so it will be able to, to delete it. So hopefully here this video is taking, it's taking a while. Okay, so now you're going to hit yes, return. Yes, return, yes, return, yes, return. Just keep on going all the way through. So I do not need any of this stuff on my iPad too. Okay, so then you're going to hit yes, return. And now what it's going to do is it's going to com compute <clears throat> like how much space, whatever, what have you. It'll pretty much, I'll show you here what it's going to say. This runs way faster on the iPhone 4S. Um, iPod Touch and so on, A4 chips, it goes about this speed. Uh, iPad 2, yeah, it's taking its sweet time. My iPhone 4S, if I would have did the video with that, this thing would have been done a long time ago. Still waiting, still waiting.
Okay, so now it's saying you can keep me around. Would you like to uninstall? I just click no. Return. And now it's going to compute pretty much what I freed up, what have you. And then I'll go back into SB settings and show you exactly what it did free up and what it didn't free up here. And this works on iOS 5.0.1 as well. Because that's what I'm running on my iPad too. I ran on 4.3.3 and 5.0. So now once it gets back to here, okay, you can just hit your home button here, because it's done, close out of it, so now what we're going to do is we're going to close out of city and multitasking here, and terminal, then we'll just, uh, do that now if you look now I have 911 megabytes yep so it freed up quite a bit of space so just a short little video it actually was a long video and a tedious video but uh yep you don't have to reboot afterwards I just like doing it for the simple fact of why not just reboot it here so we'll just reboot this and yeah there you go. Free up some free space on every iDevice. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And we will catch you guys on the next video.